Bill O'Reilly just ended the anti-Trump media's reign of terror with a blistering rebuke. Bill takes on the mob by name, destroys them and exposes them as the absolute frauds that they really are. They saw dollar signs and ratings and threw truth in the garbage and one must wonder if America will ever trust the mainstream media again. Bill wrote. After the big nothing Mueller report, there should be severe scrutiny of liberal journalists who irresponsibly and dishonestly used the Russian collusion investigation to convict President Trump and members of his administration of a variety of crimes. It was the usual corrupt media play, no due process, biased speculation, incredible hatred toward a person they despise, Donald Trump. The worst offenders were CNN, MSNBC, The New York Times, and The Washington Post. To say their coverage of the Mueller investigation was disgraceful is an extreme understatement. Using anonymous sources and false assertions, these news organizations ginned up a phony narrative that divided the country and interfered with its governance. And what price will these organizations pay? Who will hold them accountable for all the deceit and incompetence? The sad truth is that some Americans will continue to pay attention to them, that's the sheep component. But the fault is not only on the left. A bunch of never-Trumpers on the right have embarrassed themselves as well. Journalists have the absolute obligation to cover an important story like the Mueller investigation aggressively. That's a given. Accusations of governmental misconduct must be vetted. But when personal or partisan emotion enter into news coverage, that's corrupt. And that's what happened during the last two years with the Mueller investigation. The situation became so extreme that Robert Mueller himself issued a statement saying a report that President Trump had ordered his attorney, Michael Cohen, to lie about the Russia thing was false. That story came from the despicable website BuzzFeed and was quickly picked up by the hate Trump media which is the game they play, disseminating unsubstantiated information from biased sources. Now, the hate Trump media will insinuate that the president did something wrong, even though Mueller spent $30 million dollars and cannot define what that something might be. However, the partisan wolves will continue to howl and jaded Americans will tune in to hear the deceitful brain and vote for political charlatans who could not care less about truth or fairness. This entire ordeal is terribly bad for America. Honesty in reporting has collapsed and partisan loathing is now the coin of the realm. This is not really about President Trump, although his election lighted the fuse. Dot correct. Then Bill dropped the hammer no, this is about a republic that has granted the press the power to make billions of dollars, but, under the Constitution, is not accountable to anyone on how they derive profit. And we now know beyond any doubt exactly how many media operations are making money. That is by peddling false narratives and rank hatred. Paging Edward R. Murrow.